Inside Prince William and Kate Middleton's secret visit to Meghan Markle at Frogmore Cottage. It looks like those rumors of a feud between Kate Middleton and Meghan Markle can be put to rest because Prince William and Middleton secretly visited Markle at Frogmore Cottage recently. That's a pretty sweet gesture in the face of oh so many rumors about royal drama. Meghan Markle missed the Easter Sunday service. On Easter Sunday, and the Queen's birthday this year, members of the royal family gathered at church for an Easter service. Markle was noticeably absent especially since Prince Harry attended the service by himself. Had Markle already given birth or was she gearing up to have the baby soon? Was she just very pregnant and needed to rest? There was plenty of speculation but, of course, not too many answers given that Prince Harry and Markle are hoping to keep the details of their first child's arrival under wraps. Prince William and Middleton visited Markle after the service. According to a report from Harper's Bazaar, Prince William and Middleton popped over to Frogmore Cottage following the Easter service to see how Markle was doing. This was the Cambridge's first visit to Prince Harry and Markle's new home as they recently moved in following a renovation project. Prince William and Middleton reportedly brought along a housewarming gift, showing they are definitely thoughtful guests. A source told Bazaar more specifically that William and Catherine visited because Meghan was unable to attend the service. They wanted to be supportive and see how she is doing. It was a lovely afternoon. Prince Harry and Middleton teamed up. Later in the week, Royal baby watchers were certain that Markle hadn't yet given birth when Prince Harry showed up for the Anzac Day service of commemoration and thanksgiving at Westminster Abbey, which he attended with Middleton. Prince Harry and Markle's Instagram account shared photos, explaining the details of the service. Today, the Duke of Sussex attends the hashtag Anzac Day service at Westminster Abbey with the Duchess of Cambridge and the Duke of Gloucester. Hashtag Anzac Day commemorates the anniversary of the Anzac landings at Gallipoli in 1915. Anzac Day is a moment to recognize the Australian and New Zealand Army Corps who lost their lives during the landings, and to honor the sacrifices of men and women in all wars. It's believed that Harry certainly wouldn't leave Markle at home if she was in labor or had just had the baby. Markle's mother, Doria Ragland reportedly flew from the U.S. to be by her daughter's side leading many to believe that the baby will arrive soon. Prince William gave a Baby Sussex update. Even Prince William doesn't know the latest about Baby Sussex. He gave a bit of a surprising update when asked during his visit to New Zealand. Any sign of the royal baby? His response? I haven't got my phone on me. I have no idea. You guys will find out before I do at this rate. Prince Harry and Markle are trying to maintain privacy surrounding the birth of their first child with Buckingham Palace releasing a statement earlier this month that noted, The Duke and Duchess of Sussex are very grateful for the goodwill they have received from people throughout the United Kingdom and around the world as they prepare to welcome their baby. Their royal highnesses have taken a personal decision to keep their plans around the arrival of their baby private. The Duke and Duchess look forward to sharing the exciting news with everyone once they have had an opportunity to celebrate privately as a new family.